everyone. Happy Monday. I just did an essentials class. Got up and I did a 6.30 class because we had so many orders come through for the Black Friday sale. So the people that were only on the VIP list, there's another order. Got a text and an email. Um, obviously before I announce it to everyone else that's not on there and let's just say we're going to be very busy today thank you so much um yeah so that's the plans for today i'm gonna to go have a shower wash my hair these are my lips as well the lighting's probably really bad i don't even know why i decided to start the vlog in pitch black anyways yeah i need to go wash my hair have brekkie and then i will head to the warehouse Hello everyone in the warehouse. Um, it is two o'clock, so Liv has gone. We have, oh my gosh, we have packed so many orders. I'm still going, but we'll probably will continue tomorrow anyways. But yeah, I just wanted to come on and say thank you so much for all of your support. I was just saying on Instagram, I would switch up my jewelry more often because obviously it makes sense. Like I own a jewelry brand. I'm on social media. I should be wearing my pieces, which I do, but I really rarely change my pieces because I made my jewelry to be able to wear in the shower. But yeah, I made my pieces to wear every single day and that's what I do. Like I literally can't remember the last time I took this off or maybe to tan um, last time, but I wear all of my stuff, all of my earrings um, in the shower. The only pieces that I don't wear in the shower are like my chunkier pieces, um, like my chunkier boulder hoops, just because like they're not the most comfortable pieces to sleep in. Um, but even if you did wear them in the shower, nothing would happen to them. Um, and like my like chunkier rings with cubic zirconias on them, like they're best to not wear in the shower but like i feel like with those kinds of bolder statement pieces you wouldn't really not take them off um but yeah other than those kinds of pieces like all my necklaces all my rings i never my bracelet my more my more cuff can't remember the last time i took it off all of our pieces are really customizable like we've got so many plain chains that you can buy um and then charms obviously you don't need to buy like our chains, like if you've got your own chain, you can literally just purchase the charms and put them on your own necklaces. But I made this one up, which is so cute. It's got the um, Capricorn charm and then the little Cornicello charm on it. Like you can stack charms on your necklaces, like how cute and like thoughtful as well, especially if it's for a gift. Um, we also do have letter charms as well, so you can personalize it like that. But we have so many charms, like all the charms that I launched with, like angel charm, butterfly charm, and more charm, they're still on the website. Anyways, been super busy today, gonna go for a walk later on. Um, and then my friend Vic actually leaves to the UK for another three months um, again. So I'm gonna say goodbye to her tonight. We'll probably have dinner or something like that. And yeah, that's basically it. And then I'm just gonna do all this again tomorrow until all the orders are packed obviously um but yeah oh yeah lip update they're definitely getting a lot better i absolutely just love them good morning everyone happy tuesday i've just pulled up at essentials gonna go do a pilates class riley's apparently coming so we'll see if she turns up um but yeah that's the plans for this morning and then I'll probably go straight into the warehouse and continue packing all of your orders from Black Friday. But yeah, I need to go in now because otherwise I will be late. It's literally 7.28. Oh, Riley's calling me. What's she doing? Yes. Are you here? Yeah. Is there a parker on the front? No, nah, I just took the last one. Okay, but there so would be one on the... Here. Okay, around the back. I'm just pulling in. Okay. Okay. All right. Um, okay. I'm it's in socks, eh? Because I'm in yeah. shoes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. No. <laughs> All right. Bye. Okay. Bye.
everyone. I'm in the warehouse packing some of your orders. Just a little time lapse for Instagram stories. But yeah, this is pretty much what I've been doing for the past couple of hours or so. Um, yeah, that's all I have to really update you with. I think I might have lunch soon um, because I'm starving. Oh my God, cute. Love this packaging. Maybe I should zoom up a little bit more. Um, yeah, I might heat up one of my meals and have some lunch soon because, yeah, like I said, I am starving. Give her a jewelry cloth. But yeah, this is pretty much the process of packing orders very repetitive but I find it really therapeutic like I genuinely enjoy doing it so that's why I'm here today like I mean I probably well it's not like I didn't need to because Liv's here tomorrow but I didn't actually have anything planned for the day so I was like you know what I'm just gonna come in and get a head start so Liv doesn't have to do like 200 orders tomorrow by herself well I'd probably help her actually um, so yeah, that is basically it. Also guys, I haven't forgotten about the weekly makeup and beauty giveaway. I just actually DM'd one girl. Her name is Lay. Leilani and I'm just packaging up her little goodie bag. I've just kind of like filled it up. We've got some eye masks, serum, Ciate London, Emco Beauty. We've got Colourpop, Tan. What's this? Dewy Drops. Anyways, like I said, you guys know what to do. Comment on my recent photos. Leave a comment here on YouTube and I'll just literally choose a couple of winners every week. So yeah, I um, sent last week's off. I don't think they've received it yet though. Um, I think her name was Tracy. I might have to follow up to see if she's gotten it. But yes, this one is going to Queensland. I don't know what that is though. Wynnum West. No idea. Anyways, that is your little goodie bag. Um, I got some more of the, is it the AW1 collection? Like their newest release. And I am actually obsessed with these bodysuits. I got them in a couple more colors. And then these are the same parachute pants, which I'm pretty sure are still on sale for Black Friday. These are the beige pair, but they're kind of like throwing like a light khaki vibe, kind of similar to my motel ones. But yeah, love this fit. Um, I'm just printing off more orders for live tomorrow. I need to go have lunch because I am starving. I just needed to catch up on a few emails. Um, I was gonna go to an event today, but I just don't think I'll have the time just because I've got some stuff to do. And it starts really early at like 4.30 or something. Um, yeah, I think I'm just gonna stay here and just like get this done. finished a session just did a boxing session at essentials and now I'm heading home to shower protein shake and then heading into the warehouse with Liv today we have holy hell so many orders from Black Friday like it is 
insane like I went in yesterday by myself to try and keep on top of it but we had another like 80 come through last night <laughs> which is amazing obviously not complaining um, but yeah, there's just like a lot of work to be done and I'm kind of like low-key stressing because a lot of styles are selling out and I don't think I will get them back in until next year. So yeah, if there's something that you really want by the end of the year, I would definitely jump on and grab it because yeah, like I did, I have placed my next bulk order, but yeah, like obviously it takes a long time. Um, so yeah, I just don't think I'll be getting some styles in until early next year. So Anyways, I need to go. Hello everyone. Oh, I feel like I haven't actually sat down. Well, I have actually sat down today, but I have just been packing orders. Liv was here for pretty much the whole morning. She just left just before and I just continued to pack some orders. Um, I honestly thought we'd get them all done today, but Oh, I think we still have 80 left, but obviously people are still making orders because the sale is still on. So yeah, I'll probably be back here tomorrow. Oz Post normally comes at 12 o'clock every day, um, but obviously after they pick it up, we're still packing orders. So I'm gonna go and do a post office drop of what we got done after they came and picked up the other um, bag. So yeah, that's pretty much all to update you guys with. Whoa, I'm like all oily. I only have sunscreen on my face. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm actually so tired from uh, the gym this morning because I wasn't actually gonna go and then last minute we decided we were gonna go. I'm glad that I did because otherwise I feel like I wouldn't have nearly as much energy as I do now, even though I feel tired. Yeah, just wanted to give you guys an update, even though I feel like this week is gonna be so repetitive because it is pretty much me doing the same thing. I did receive some really exciting samples, which I mean, I'm just gonna show you guys. Uh, I got the final, or not the final, I got the first edit of our video that we shot. We did that shoot a few weeks ago and I'm obsessed, but I feel like this is like a big clue. I feel like, I don't know, some of you already know what it is, um, but This is only just a sample, that's why it's all like flimsy. So I'm just gonna leave that there. I'm so excited, I'm getting my other packaging samples very soon. So I'm really excited to see it all come together. Um, yeah, that's it. I'm gonna log off now. And yeah, I'll see you guys later. Morning. Oh no, I've got low battery, I need to change it. Um, I am off to boxing with Cohen again. <sighs> Hopefully I can get the hang of footwork, which was a struggle last time. And again, it was my first session. So I need to cut myself some slack. It's not easy to learn um, all of that stuff in like the one session, but yeah, I'm excited to go back and do another lesson. Um, oh, sorry, I thought I'd show you guys. Sorry, my battery just died, but this is the fit. I love these leggings from Lorna Jane. I got them last week. I've worn them so many times since. They're so nice and flattering. So that's the leggings. And then I'm just wearing like a Stax crop underneath this Remy tank. She's black and white today. Anyways, that's the fit. Um... Yeah, I need to leave soon, actually. I am actually, I'm decluttering this wardrobe, honestly. If you saw, like, look, I've just got clothes. Like, there's clothes on my makeup desk. There's clothes left, right, and center as soon as you walk in here. It's, like, overwhelming. And I don't even wear half of them. That's the thing. Like, I hold on to clothes thinking I'm going to wear them, and I just never wear them. So I'm going to have to be really brutal and just yeet. If I'm not going to wear it or if I, if I haven't worn it yet and I bought it, yeet. Like, why is it in my wardrobe? Because it just ends up on the floor and I, like, don't have any more space. As you can see, my coat hangers are, like, bursting at the seams. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to do today. And I'm probably just going to, like, put a pile together and just go take it to Vinnie's or something. Because there's just going to be so much stuff 
um, and I'll let you know which videos I drop it to in case you guys want to go there. It's just so much easier when you've got so many clothes just to take it to Vinnie's. Um, I know like a lot of people do try and sell their clothes on Depop, which I do have some stuff on Depop, but honestly, it's just like so hard to keep on top of. Um, like I'll keep the stuff that I have on Depop, but I think I'm just going to um, go and take like a big donation um, bag to Vinnie's. But yeah, it needs to be done because every single time I walk into this room, I like get so overwhelmed. Okay, well, I will talk to you soon. Hey guys, I'm currently filming my decluttering. This is the result so far. I've literally cleared one whole rack of clothes and I've condensed it down into one full rack. But then again, I've got so much stuff on the floor that like has been on the floor for a long time that I need to hang up. This is my donation pile. I've got some garbage bags that I'm gonna put them into. Oh, I'm sweating. Hello everyone, happy Friday. I feel like this week has gone so quick just because we have been so busy with all the Black Friday sales. We still have, we're still trying to catch up, but um, yeah, we still have over a hundred orders um, needing to be printed and we still have, how many have been printed that we haven't done? Maybe like 80? Yeah, there's just, there's so many. Um, I'm going to go into the warehouse today and help Liv uh, pack some orders. But um, first, I'm going to go and get my lips massaged. I feel like the lighting could be better. There we go. Yeah, I'm going to go get my lips massaged, um, which is just like what, I don't know, a requirement that she does instead of... So I've always had to massage my own lips after getting my lips done when I've gone to other places, but she told me not to touch mine and for me to come in for like 10 minutes and yeah she just massages the lips it's not painful or anything like that because I've already kind of like healed um so yeah that's what I'm doing today and also after she massages my lips she's also going to do that treatment that I was talking about last week called pro profilo profilo where it's basically um, hyaluronic acid injections into the face. And it lasts about three months, kind of the same as Botox, um, three to four months. And yeah, apparently it's meant to give you a really hydrated, like youthful look, which I mean, right now I feel like because I've got moisturizer on, SPF on, um, my face does actually look quite plump. I find that sometimes my face just looks dull. Um, you probably have noticed because you watch my vlogs. But um, yeah, then, then some days my face looks really nice and radiant. Like today, it doesn't look too bad. Um, yeah. Also, I've got two massive pimples and guess what it's from. It has to be this product because I haven't used it for months. And I've, like, I can't remember the last time I had gotten breakouts like this like big like almost like blind pimple vibes and then when they come to the top and you pop it it's like it turns into a scab this i was like you know what i'm gonna give another go I'm using this just as like a i don't know like a primer and nothing else on top and i have gotten two massive pimples on my face it has to, that has to be it like there's nothing else that I've tried that's different oh, which is so annoying because it just looks so nice on the face but I've got other products that'll do the same thing but I was like you know what I'm just gonna give another go but that's going in the actual bin like that's not happening again anyways I'm going now I think I'm just gonna leave my hair like this because like it's not like I can like tie it back because I'm laying down the whole time but yeah I will see you when I get there 
It's actually not too bad. I thought mm -hmm. it'd be worse because mm -hmm. I was watching videos on TikTok mm -hmm. yeah. and um, just from their face, like mm -hmm. they were like, ooh, but yeah, it's just a little sting. It's just a little sting and the yeah. pressure. Yeah, it's not, I expected worse. Mm -hmm. Hello everyone. I am just in the warehouse. Obviously, like you saw, I didn't actually film too much of it, but I did get that treatment that I was talking about um, earlier this morning. Um, I did, I'm not sure if you can really see, but she did six injections on each side of my face. And for about two or three hours, I did have, it like kind of looked like blind pimples, like where she had injected the like hyaluronic acid serum or whatever she used. Well, not whatever she used. It's like hyaluronic acid. I think she said it's like a booster, like a hyaluronic acid booster. Um, yeah, I don't know if you can really tell. It's definitely gone down a lot, but yeah, apparently I should be able to see, oh yeah, I can kind of feel it up here. It's like a big, it's almost like, yeah, it feels like a blind pimple. Um, underneath my skin apparently it takes about two weeks for it to Start and then for the full effect four weeks from now. So I'm really excited um, Obviously you guys will be able to tell straight away because I obviously vlog all the time um, But yeah, I don't have anything on my face at the moment. Oh my god. That feels so weird. I feel like I've got something underneath my skin So random anyways, I actually got some packages which i'll show you guys later on they were delivered to mums because they couldn't be delivered to a po box because i bought them from i think or is aritzia from london yeah anyways i bought a blazer from aritzia and what else did i get i can't remember what mum said i i got another package anyways um that i had to get delivered to mum's house but yeah we finally finished packing all of the black friday orders we will be having some sort of cyber monday sale but that still isn't confirmed yet so keep your eye out if you're on the mailing list you'll be the first to find out but we just did uh finalize our 12 days of christmas promo which will be rolling out on the 1st of december again you need to be a part of our mailing and sms subscription list to be the first to know um but yeah there's some really really cool um deals every single day so yeah you just need to be yeah subscribed to know i don't really have anything planned for this weekend actually i haven't really been out and about much um just because i've been so busy throughout the week and i've just been so exhausted good morning guys i just want to show you my very aesthetic breakfast good morning, Banda. <laughs> with my chow bella plate my green matcha my avocado my tahine yum Hello everyone, happy Saturday. Say hello. Oh, hey. <laughs> I'm trying to drive. <laughs> um, we're going to try and do some Christmas shopping today and take advantage of the Black Friday sales. It's probably going to be so busy at Pack Fair, but. I really don't want to go. I know, but we'll see. Why are we we'll going? We'll see how we go. I don't know. I need it's to get stuff. <laughs> I know, but I just need to get stuff. Um, yeah, so we're going to Harvey Norman first just to see if they've got something in stock. If not, yeah, where are we going to go if they don't have them in Harvey Norman Meyer? Or like the good guys or something? They said it's sold out everywhere, so. We'll yeah, it's no one of our one of my presents that I want to get someone. It's literally sold out everywhere, so yeah. Um, but yeah, anyways, I'll keep you updated on that. Actually, I probably won't because they might watch this vlog and they'll probably know that it's for them, so. Um, yeah. We'll keep you updated if I find any good deals, I guess. Happy Sunday. I just went down and got my delivery from Chef Good. Oh, I thought this was the Cajun chicken. I definitely like the Cajun chicken better, but um, yeah, that's not my favorite meal. The This is my favorite, the braised lamb sag. So good. I got two of those. That one's also really good. This one's also really good. So is this. I mainly get that one for Peter. Uh, that's a bit spicy for my liking, but I also do love the spaghetti bolognese. Yum. Hello everyone, happy Sunday. I haven't really vlogged much because I haven't really done an awful lot, except I did finish my wardrobe. So I'll show you guys that after. Um, also, 
the whole reason why I didn't do a haul from when we went shopping was because I literally only got one thing. <laughs> and that was three packets of these mini candy canes that I can put in your guys' orders in December. And that's all. I was just so overwhelmed. Like there was just so many people. Peter actually desperately needed to get like new clothes for Dubai. Um, so he actually bought quite a bit of stuff. But I was just like, like I, I just wanted to get out. Um, the sales weren't like that good. Like I think like South Street and stuff had like 20% off. And yeah, just I, I'm, it wasn't like that big of a saving really like i feel like online was probably better cotton on yeah they had like 30 percent off everything um but like i would just much prefer to shop online which i have been doing um like i just placed a i placed a cotton on order what else have i done skims i'll show you guys that all when they come um yeah they had like their biannual sale which wasn't like that good to be honest um but i just wanted some of those bike pants sculpt thingy-majiggies that I can put underneath my um, fitted dresses because I really like the way that Riley's looked when I borrowed hers. Um, what else did I get? I definitely did another order. Can't remember. Anyways, you'll see what I got. But um, yeah, I've just been editing this vlog that you're watching and yeah, I'll show you guys my wardrobe. I'm just about to heat up a meal for lunch but yeah this is what the wardrobe looks like i can't believe i basically have like one big rack left um that i can fill which i don't have clothes for and yeah it's just so i actually might even hang up some stuff here because all of this stuff is like gym crops gym tanks and then in there is like my tank tops that i wear like daily like all my skims ones and stuff like that um, and then gym tights in that one. And then I've got some other gym stuff there. Um, I still need to sort this mess out because it's just, it's not a vibe. I just feel so much lighter, like just without all of that clutter there for no reason. Like I wasn't even wearing it. So why have it and hoard it for no reason? Like I filmed a TikTok, like decluttering stuff. And I was like trying on outfits and whatever and like I literally had this like leopard puffer jacket that I got from is it DJ Cooper I never know how to say that brand I bought it literally like as soon as I moved to Perth so like four years ago and I have just have never worn it since I left Perth yeah I had so many jackets and jumpers that I just wouldn't reach for now um which is like pretty much like the bulk of my clothes that was taking up the most room in my wardrobe um, but yeah, it just feels so good just to declutter. But um, yeah, I'm going to end this vlog here because it's obviously Sunday afternoon. I will see you guys next week. Bye.